Hello everyone, Sam is here from MyFirstMagicWave.com I'm making this a small video uh, at the end of the week, a weekly recap. So let's get started. Uh, I made a small video uh, on uh, Wednesday, I guess, right? At the end of the uh, uh, Wednesday, uh, the middle of the week recap. Uh, but the rest of the week, the you know, it's like we had Thanksgiving, Saturday, and Black Friday, you know, so trading is kind of messed up. <laughs> so <laughs> not too much to show, but I'm I want to show the long-term charts, uh, how uh, you know we traded and how what my analysis was. So let's get started. This one, uh, not let's go back on the first twenty-first. Um, Okay, this is the uh, pound yen 20 minute uh, chart on 21st. Um, let me show you the main chart, the reason, and then this is strategy, uh, you know, the entry system, you can say, uh, magic IV system, the, the blue candles and the red candles comes very, very handy uh, with my analysis. So I, I took a lot along the last week and week before. Uh, let me show you why. Uh, you will understand that why I'm not taking this small and taking only the long one. You know, there's a reason behind it. <clears throat> so, let's see this one. Um, here, <clears throat> see this 18th November? This was the chart that uh, yen, pound yen is going up and the target, the first target, it will probably going to go up and have, we do have a second target. But the first target was 140. This line here and this shaded area, maybe it will go up a little bit more to touch the other uh, sloping trend line. And that's what happened to this chart. Exactly, you know, I was, I was expecting, right? So based on that, you know, I took this uh, pound yen long. And let me see if I can show you some other pound yen long. This one on the 23rd and point pound yen uh, long this one on the 24th. After that, this is the 23rd one, then came back a little bit, retracement, and then 24th it went up again because I just showed you the long-term charts where it was going. First target was 140. We ended up uh, 141 something. And hopefully, you know, it is more uh, to come uh, to the upside in pound yen. Okay, so this is how uh, the pound yen went. Uh, and let me now go back and show you the rest of the... the so this was pound yen uh, and then uh, pound USD, uh, small trade here, uh, pound Aussie, uh, it went up uh, also, right? Uh, and the reason uh, I was uh, going long on pound Aussie, that was the first one and on 21st, this one is on 23rd, is also, let me show you the long term chart for that, was this one. This is the 23rd chart, you can see 23rd October, that is a weekly chart. Now we're going to go all the way up to around this area, 68, 65, 69, or 9, maybe, you know, or 70, 36, something like that, right? So what happened to this chart all this time today as of um, uh, as 26th? Here we are. So we went up all the way, right? And going uh, to the upside, I was taking long on my, you know, from 20 minutes uh, and, and, and 40 minute uh, chart, I mean, uh, trade setups. All right, so that's the reason. Uh, this is another just uh, small Euro USD and USD franc. This is another you just showed you uh, pound yen, right? And um, there was probably USD yen as well. Why yen? Uh, USD yen I took long as well. So for reason for Euro yen, USD yen, pound yen, Aussie yen, all those uh, went up. Let me show you why. Uh, was is the reason for that this chart see this is yen index and yen index uh, on the 30th 13th of November I made the chart that's gonna go around this area 5473 was the number and the TL okay now yen index going up means yen is getting uh, weaker and yen is always on the right hand side on all of those pairs right yen is the weakest currency so uh, <clears throat> When yen index goes up or gets weaker, all the yen pairs will go up, right? So that's why pound yen was going up, euro yen you can see went up, right? Aussie yen went up, 
and uh, uh, USDN, I took the trades. I was trading. Uh, you cannot trade all of them, right? But the thing is, the good thing is, uh, knowing these charts uh, is uh, index charts is that uh, you get to pick and choose so many trades there. You know all the yen pairs gonna go up. So you see which one is giving you best setup on a 40 minute or 20 minute chart. Which which one has more momentum, the angle of the the going up, you know, and uh, you just uh, take and which one posting big ranges. For example, one of the, the other pair. For example, um, now I'm not gonna say the name, but you know, there's if, if yen is getting weaker and the other currency is also getting weaker, that pair is not gonna go, uh, you know, move much to the upside because both currencies are getting weaker. So you have to see which one. And then I obviously, when I do my webinars, and if you subscribe, you get to know all of those things. You, when you, uh, I do the webinar, I explain everything uh, the way I'm doing now, right? So uh, long-term chart, what will happen? So what happened to this chart? Exactly where I said there's gonna go and hit the teal, it did. And because of that, all those yen pairs went up, okay? So uh, this is how my analysis is, and um, and you see so many, and obviously I showed you this this one, and then this one here, and let me show you something else was uh, Aussie yen chart, uh, for example this one, okay, October 22nd, and went up the, all the way up here, and and right now the yen is keep getting weaker, so it might go a little more to the upside, Aussie yen weekly chart, see how many pips it went up. And then look at this one, USD yen. I made this chart long time ago, September, and saying this: if 50% holds, might go back to 23.6% line. And I was pointing out and showing this 23.6% line, and I erased all the other levels from the pip, uh, from the the fib area. All right, but this is 50%. What happened to this chart? Exactly to the pip, it went up and it hit 23% line. This is a thousand pip move to the upside. Thousand pip guys, thousand pip straight. Okay, so you know, uh, and and all you gotta do is, and if if I show you USD yen, my twenty minute chart, uh, it's so beautiful, and all you had to do is just take the setups, nothing else. Let me show you. It's so easy and it's so beautiful. Um, when you have my analysis on one hand, what happened here? Oh, okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is a 20 minute chart. All of this turn was made uh, here, right? And then look, this was an entry, this was an entry. Every time this indicator comes down all the way and then red candle turns into blue, that's an entry. So this was an entry, 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 and this was an entry. Going thousand pip to the upside, and not only you could easily make more than thousand because every time you make and then red candle comes, you close the trade, let it retrace a little bit, it comes back hundred, you know, fifty pip, sixty pip, seventy pip, then get in again. So you're making, you know, you're making hundred pip, it drops again, and then you, you know, go with that again, knowing that what is happening. And I showed you uh, one of my USD. Uh, I I don't trade this pair much. I usually uh, trade, you can see the pound yen and pound Aussie and euro. So, but the trade opportunities with the system is everywhere, everywhere. And, uh, you know, with my charts. So this is, I uh, just wanted to show you guys, and, you know, if you're interested, go on my website, subscribe, uh, check it out. Um, all the charts are there, all, the, all other videos are there. And um, uh, if you want, you can just, you know, subscribe and then start trading the way I'm trading. And I know exactly where it's going to go now, but, uh, you know, you, when you subscribe, you get the whole thing. And especially, uh, you know what, my alarm, uh, the IB alarm system, uh, not system, but it's an EA, EA, simply. When the the, the setup is there, it be, start beeping. So you don't even have to you stick to the, you know, charts all the time, watching, you know, what's happening for the setup. You open the charts, uh, the 40-minute charts and 20-minute charts. This is a 20-minute chart, you know. Look how many entries. Just keep going. Every time it comes down, just go long, long, long. Um, <clears throat> look at that. Look at that. All of these were entries. This one, this one, this one, this one. And then every entry you take, it never comes back. You know, your yourself don't hit. See this one? This one gone up. This one gone up. You know. Now probably making this, you know, doing a little uh, correction is due probably. 
Anyway, so uh, the alarm, you know, start beeping when you have the setup, okay? And uh, it makes the life uh, much easier now. <laughs> okay. So um, this is it for now. Uh, like I said, if you like it, go on my website. See, if you are doing good, if you are trading profitably, don't even go on my website. Keep doing it. Disregard my video. Okay. My intention and my, my one is to, to uh, teach people how to trade who are not trading profitably. If you are trading profitably, don't even think about, you know, changing your st strategy or scenarios. Stick to what it is working for you. That's the idea. Okay. This thing works for me. My analysis and not only for me, if I show you the emails that how people are responding and how happy they are. You will be amazed. Okay. Uh, maybe one day I'll just collect all those emails and put on my website as testimonial or something. Uh, but um, yeah, this is how it is. So um, this is it for now. Thanks for watching, and uh, you know, enjoy the rest of the weekend. Tomorrow Sunday, here is Saturday night, and uh, I may see you in my webinars. Right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.